Buonasera a tutti ragazzi e ragazze, benvenuti e bentornati sul mio canale. Andiamo avanti con, la con Life is Strange Remastered e niente, siamo ormai credo quasi alla fine del eh, primo capitolo, vedremo un po' come andrà e che cosa succederà in questa puntata. Io vi auguro buona visione, come sempre se siete nuovi vi invito ad iscrivervi al canale e attivare la campanella per ricevere le notifiche sull'uscita dei prossimi contenuti. Noi ci vediamo tra pochissimo in partita. Ok, allora, come vi dicevo, siamo ancora all'episodio 2. Eh, abbiamo passato una bella giornata con eh, Chloe e adesso vediamo un po' che succede. Che cavolo dobbiamo fare? Ah no, qua non credo che ci sia scritto. Faccio un po' di caos con Life is Strange, True Colors. Abbiamo conosciuto Frank... E Joyce non dimenticherò mai Frank forse perché è la prima e ultima persona a cui abbia, potuto, a cui abbia eh, puntato una pistola ah giusto 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 è finita Chloe nel radar di, quello, di questo spacciatore schizzato come c'è finita Chloe nel radar di questo spacciatore schizzato la cosa strana è che quando l'ho visto minacciare Chloe alla discarica sono rimasta sorpresa da quanto fosse normale mi aspettavo di vedere una, una sorta di gangster ma sembrava più un perdente che vive nella spazzatura sì in effetti immagino lo sia visto che eravamo nel suo territorio a testare il mio potere per intrattenere Chloe anche se non sembrava un serial killer le sue vibrazioni, energia, aura quello che è, erano cattive mi ha fatto venire la pelle d'oca voleva i soldi che gli deve Chloe quindi non aveva senso farle del male ma non ho voluto correre il rischio quindi l'ho minacciato con la pistola di David assurdo, fortunatamente non abbiamo fatto la fine delle Iene e ho visto che Frank, che forse Frank non fa paura come pensavo eppure non voglio che Chloe sia, gli si avvicini mai più siccome indossava uno dei braccialetti di Rachel Amber per qualche eh, di ragione dubito che Chloe voglia rivederlo ma è diventato il sospettato numero uno ok e poi Joyce la mamma di Chloe eh, parlare con Joyce Price dopo cinque anni è stato intenso quasi quanto rivedere Chloe soprattutto al buon vecchio dinner Two wall, walls, spero di averlo letto bene. Il titinio delle posate, l'odore della pancetta sfrigolante mi ha fatta tornare bambina quando venivo a fare colazione qui con i miei genitori. Joyce aveva sempre un sorriso per Clo, anche quando faceva qualche marachella. Dubito che ora sorrida alle sue bravate, ma, continua a ma continuano a scambiarsi battute come madre e figlia. Mi sono trasferita a Seattle dopo tutto la, dopo, subito dopo la morte di William. Non so come che deve essere il papà appunto di Chloe, non so come l'abbia vissuta Joyce, ma sono felice che non, si, che non sia incavolata con me per essere stata così egoista e non essermi mai, mai voltata indietro. Ricordo ancora l'ultima volta che io e Chloe l'abbiamo visto vivo, mi chiedo se Joyce rivive quel, spesso quel giorno. Il peggior tipo di viaggio nel tempo, non lo puoi controllare. Se potessi tornare indietro cosa farei? Eh, in effetti noi non sappiamo di cosa, come è morto, quando è morto, cioè quando è morto sì, insomma, però insomma di cosa è mo si è morto il papà di, di Chloe. Posso solo immaginare come Joyce sia finita con David Manson, gli opposti si attraggono, come si suol dire, per quanto possa suonare strano si vede che lei lo ama, forse voleva solo una vita un po' più strutturata, ma non ha funzionato per Chloe, spero che Chloe e David li tra la trattino bene, Joyce si merita al meglio. Va bene. Non ho capito cosa devo fare qua io, ragazzi, eh. Dove dobbiamo... David. Parliamo un po' con David. Scusami, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? Uh, sì. Yes, it was. You know that marijuana is almost legal in Oregon. I can get it at Blackwell. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. Mm, buona sapersi, buona sapersi. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. <laughs> She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. 
Ha trattato male Kate? Che problema ha con Kate? Che problema ha con Kate? What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. Ci dobbiamo fidare. More than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Sembra quasi stato messo in riga. Ok, abbiamo un messaggio sul diario. Cioè, un messaggio. Uh, Ehi, hey, zia. Sono nel laboratorio di fantascienze ora. Non sono il gatto di... Shro Vabbè, va bene, eh. Attrapa Dobbiamo andare nel laboratorio di fantascienze. Ho ancora tempo. Potrei andare a vedere Warren giocando a mad scientist in the lab. Ho visto Victoria e i suoi amici shopping per la party. Mi ricorda me. Ho bisogno di scuola un po' di Nathan. Ok. Se abbiamo solo da guardare lo stesso. Parliamo Yo, con Ethan. Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? Ci sentiamo dopo, ok? Va bene. You have so to you talk can't to me, Kate. Me? I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Hmm, che cosa aveva Victoria? Parliamo Sorry con Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. David Madsen. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Tutti lo sanno. Kate è spaventata. Uh, tutti lo sanno. Everybody knows. That's why I wanted to see you. Kate is being humiliated daily. What if Kate brought this on herself? Mm. She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? No. Chiamata persa. I will. She's mad I missed her call today. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. Nathan Prescott. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girl's bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. Ma è vero. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Hello. Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Ah, era qua che dovevamo andare. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Bo, bo, bo. Dina, I'm kind of doing do something look, now, Dina? Max. You look like ass. Sì, in effetti sta scattando le foto. Daniel, parliamo con What's Daniel. Daniel. Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. Vediamo il disegno se ci fa fare qualcosa. Guarda. That's a great sketch of Dana. Daniel is the real deal. Alissa. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating mm, shit. Contempli la pioggia. Foto. D. 
diario. Oh, abbiamo le foto. Non l'avevo visto. Wow, dobbiamo fare tutte queste foto. Oddio mio. Ho fatto pochissime foto. Devo stare molto più attenta ai particolari. Solo che appunto già mi scuso perché ci sono certe puntate no che sono durate tanto. Posing in progress. Sì, continua a posare, dai ma... No, volevo parlare con Taylor, ma va bene. Oh. Oh, I'm... Better be quiet, Victoria. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore or I get nasty. Too late. Oh, burn! Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. In fact, shit's just starting, Max. Oh, stay bassino, ragazzo. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. In effetti. Qua che cavolo dobbiamo fare noi ragazzi? What up, Max? Hey Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit down. We have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually, people need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. Che problemi hai? We can Bello, thank reality and TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking of participation, there are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I guess Kate will miss class now. Like I'm worried about her. Today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that okay, gives the power of the light. Visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my Yo! Some crazy shit is going down in the girls' dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. Dismissed. Wow, cosa sta succedendo? Corri, corri. Who is that up there? Oh no. Is that Kate? <gasps> no, aspettate. Uh, I have to do something to help. Not again. Not now. No, 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 no. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Oh dio, no, mi mi viene l'ansia, mi viene l'ansia, mi viene l'ansia. Schiatto io se riavvolgo troppe volte. Q. 
Keep going, Max. You can do it. Mamma mia. Come riesco a fare, non fare, eccetera? Dove passo? Cioè noi abbiamo praticamente bloccato il tempo in questo momento. Oh mamma mia che ansia. Yes. to do this by myself? Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Anche perché morirò di qualcos'altro, io se non Oh Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. Le cose miglioreranno, tu conti tu conti non solo per me. Tu conti non solo per me. You matter and not just to me. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. You are such a liar. You wanted to help by ignoring my phone call? La batteria era scarica, era silenziosa, ero con Chloe. Diciamogli la verità. I was with Chloe and she was having a serious problem too. I'm sorry. Apparently her problem is worse than mine. So why even bother with me? <sighs> I'm done anyway. No, you're not. And I'm here for you. I can help you now. Chiedo scusa, ma si era messo a bagliare il mio cane. I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. Sto raccogliendo prove, è troppo rischioso per noi, non ero sicura, avevo bisogno di più tempo. Sto raccogliendo prove. Kate, I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. You have proof now? Soon, then straight to the Non credono neanche a noi quando diciamo che avevamo una pistola. You do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So, I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm already on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Auguri. Sei forte, tutti dimenticheranno, esistono miliardi di video. Sei forte perché. Hey, this is our chance to beat the bullies. Mi verrebbe anche esistono miliardi di video, però. Can we really, Max? Secondo me lei non l'accetta. I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Eh, se non ci credi te, miracoli. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. Adesso te lo dimostrerò. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. Nobody cares about me. Oh, ricominci. Tua madre, le tue sorelle, tuo padre, i tuoi fratelli. Tua madre. What about your mother, Kate? You'll destroy her. She doesn't care about a video. She loves you. You don't know my mother at all. She already thinks Satan has me on the fast track to hell. Let's prove it. 
No. No. Non posso riavvolgere eh, per adesso. Kate. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us, but we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh, before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. <coughs> I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being mm -hmm. of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, non so se è colpa mia as our head of security, quando... here, those roof doors should always madre. be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson? I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Mm. Miss Caulfield. Why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Jefferson l'ha fatta piangere, David l'ha minacciata, Nathan l'ha drogata. Io direi che andiamo sul, sul più ovvio che è Nathan l'ha drogata. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're playing a liar. the field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend mm. and fellow student is dead. And they don't need this forum right now. Non so yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me. I think I can use my power again. Per quale motivo? Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. David l'ha minacciata, Nathan l'ha drogata, no, allora, quindi Jefferson l'ha fatta piangere. Jefferson l'ha fatta piangere. I saw Mr. Jefferson talking to Kate right before our class. Then she ran off crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Kate, Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh at her. She was upset Miss Caulfield didn't return her calls. 
she felt rejected by the school. She shouldn't have asked to be on video macking with some dudes. You ass! She didn't ask for any of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Now, I wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now this is problematic. The publicity is rising, and perhaps you shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes contest in San Francisco. Are you serious? I am. We don't need any negative press about that event. And we need to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures for you. I understand. There are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. Mm. Maybe you should investigate other staff members. Max told me she knew things about Mr. Madsen. Let Max speak for herself. Everything we talked about here will be looked into. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. Ok, firmiamo la dichiarazione. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I just can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a weight. I really thought I could save her. Like a superhero. Come on, Max. Do not for a second blame yourself. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Mm. Sono stata yeah, l'unica che ha fermato il tempo. Difference. Maybe if more people cared, better people than me. You're the best person around. Warren, che amore. I screwed up today. That makes no logical sense. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. <gasps> I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. Anch'io voglio un amico come Warren. Che poi non vuole essere amico. Vi chiedo scusa se alcune puntate, nel mentre lo dico, eh, sono durate più di 40 minuti, altre sono durate anche 13 minuti, insomma... Però ripeto, è difficile questo, questo, questo gioco da poter tagliare con quel non so che, che piace a me, ecco. Trovare il momento in cui tagliarlo. Però mi sta piacendo molto, molto, molto anche questo. Fatemi sapere anche voi nei commenti appunto che cosa ne pensate. Perché sembra così triste? Dai, lui col cane.
Ma Chloe ancora non si è vista? Eccola Chloe. Ok, allora, dunque, abbiamo, credo, completato anche Out of Time e direi che cominceremo, magari, la prossima puntata. Allora, ha detto, hai detto a Kate di aspettare il 47... Per, eh, di aspettare... A, di ave, hai detto a Kate di, as, di aspettare di avere prove, il 47% di persone ha risposto così. Eh, non hai risposto alla chiamata di Kate 16%, non hai provato a sparare a Frank 45%, non hai salvato... Come la gente è riuscita anche a salvarla Kate? No, dovrò rigiocarlo e riuscire a salvare Kate. Hai dato la colpa al prof Jefferson 29%. Ok, aggiorna. No, continua. Se non si dovesse sentire l'audio è per il semplice motivo che appunto ci sono delle questioni di copyright che io qua non riesco a eliminare. 